My company uh, primarily deals in the, in the defense industry and uh, we were doing a demonstration last December and I noticed these vehicles, uh, these crash attenuator vehicles and I was asking myself, what is this? It looks like a big crash barrier and we actually have a human being driving the vehicle. I realized that this would be an opportunity to maybe take the human out of this dangerous situation and automate this vehicle. We've taken their military technology that's used for protecting the men and women uh, from landmines overseas and we've worked with them in integrating it in what we call a TMA truck or truck mount attenuator. And those are the trucks that are used on a daily basis. Everybody sees them when you're going through a work zone. They have a big arrow board on them and a big old yellow thing uh, that's laid down. And that, that big old yellow thing is designed to absorb energy in the event that the motorist falls asleep, is distracted, whatever, and runs into it. The sole purpose of that TMA truck is to protect the men and women who are working in that work zone just ahead of it. And I can tell you these things are hit almost on a daily basis and they actually save lives. The technology that we are offering now in these TMA trucks is actually going to remove the driver who is highly at risk in the, sitting in that truck literally waiting to be struck. The way it works is in the leader vehicle GPS position data is being transmitted to the, the follower vehicle and uh, the, the data contains information that says, you know, this is my speed, this is my location, this is what I'm doing here and here, and the follower vehicle essentially replicates that. And this technology that we developed here seems to be something that might lend itself to a bunch of different applications. And we're talking about cutting edge hardware and software to automate these vehicles in a safe manner.